thanks for tuning in to Naturally Lash. Today, I am going to be bringing to you guys a video review for a product I'm super excited to have. So if you guys like this video, go ahead and give it two thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button down there somewhere. And I just want to go ahead and show you guys what I have. Um, this is what it came in mystery box there was actually a part on the outside that got taken off one of my kids took it but we have the vr box so this is what we have it's a virtual reality glasses set and i'm just gonna talk to you guys a little bit about this product and let you guys know what i really thought about it so from the start um like i said it came inside of this box right here um there's nothing in there right now and it also had your product manual. It just gives you a oop. <laughs> it gives you just a little um, you know, oversight of, you know, how to get it set up and everything that should be in here and how to insert your phone into this little slot over here and what you can expect. Um, also in here, I don't have it right now, there was a little um, QR code circle. You want to make sure that you um, scan that onto your phone so you can get everything set up because you will be using your phone to um, play like either the movies or the games or the apps that you're downloading. It also came with a nice little um, cloth for cleaning off the glasses and I'll show you why you might need this in just a second and an alcohol wipe so oh wait and one more thing and it also has your handy dandy controller that's the controller this is bluetooth enabled you have your toggle stick and you can switch it from ios i don't know if you can see that from ios to android mine is currently set for android because that's the kind of phone that i have and it takes two triple a mm, two triple a batteries and you have your buttons and everything going here and there is a little paper that's included that lets you know how to use the controller so now we're gonna get into the actual set so first thing you have here is this front part and you can move that over just like that um, I guess that's for if you want to use the camera feature on your phone so you can slide that back over when you're using it for your games and getting your different apps Right here on the front, this allows for like the sound to come out. It's almost like a speaker, but you know, the sound is really coming from your phone. And then you have your tray right here. This right here, it adjusts. If you see this little piece right here, it goes up to adjust for your phones. And it also comes with these little rubber pads. Right here, you should get three of them. And you use these just to kind of help protect your phone because this will be a pretty um, snug fit. I have a Note 3 and it's a pretty snug fit when I put my phone in here. Um, I will say um, about the durability of this thing, it kind of worries me a little bit. I'm always scared that I may crack it somehow. So do be careful with it because it's not super thin plastic but it is plastic and there is the possibility that you can crack it if you're being too rough with it so once you've inserted your phone you know what matter of fact i'm gonna go grab my phone so i can show you guys how to do that Ta-da! we have my phone all right so what you want to do you're going to take this piece right here like that and that's where you're going to set your phone in boom and your phone should fit in there just like that and you can kind of adjust it you know back and forth to you know whatever you feel is best okay so once you've done that you're going to just line it back up and inside of the headset it goes I'm gonna pull that back out really quick just so I can go on now I'm gonna move it to the side at the top you see these two little switches right here now if you look at these from the inside I don't know if you can see it in there but you see how they move this is so you can adjust it to your eyes so you can see really good um, I actually really like that feature because you know some people oh <laughs> just found out something new you guys not only can they go side to side 
but they can also go forward and backwards. So just want to throw that in there. I just actually learned that I've never, you know, actually used it for that purpose. So now I know that you can adjust it forward and backwards. Um, right here, you can look on the inside and this is where you have the lenses. That also brings up why you would have, I don't know why that's stuck. Why you would have this little guy right here so that you can make sure your lenses stay nice and clear when you are using these. Around here, this whole section is padded right here. So you, it's a little bit more comfortable on your face. And um, let me see if I can pull this back up. Like overall, this whole thing is like customizable and adjustable to your head and your face. Like this little top part right here, this is, it looks kind of solid, but it actually kind of bends and molds. And then you have your three strips right here with the Velcro on it. And you can use that to adjust it back and then around so that it fits snugly on your face, but it's not so tight that it's uncomfortable. And you can also make it loose enough to where, you know, like I said, it's not uncomfortable, but it's not falling off of your face. Um, there's a little indent right here. This is for like your nose when you put it on there. In just a second, I'm going to actually put this on my face so you guys can kind of get an idea of what it looks like when it's on. And um, yeah, that's really it for the construction of it. Like I said, it's made out of plastic. Um, there's really no metal components to this. The only metal that I found on here was maybe like the little tiny screws. Um, other than that, I would just say be careful. Just be careful with it. Um, I wouldn't recommend giving it to like younger kids or anybody who may drop this item because it may break. So I'm going to take these off real quick just to show you how it looks once you put it on. It's already adjusted for my head and just like that. You see it? It's adjusted. Okay. So that's what it looks like when it's on. And as far as what it looks like once you um, put your phone in and, you know, play the app or a game, um, I've only downloaded games. I've done like maze games and like little VR roller coaster games, which I set with my child while because she really liked that. But um, overall, that experience is pretty good. Um, the whole, you know, movement tracking, everything is really good. The only thing that I would want to change about it or I don't even know if it's possible to. When you're looking inside of the headset, um, you see the image right in front of you, but then you also see black, like right here is black. So I don't know if there's some way that they can change that so maybe it's mirrored to have like the image almost look like it surrounds you maybe. Somehow, I don't know how that works, but that's really the only pet peeve I have with this system. Um, so yeah, um, overall, I give this thing two thumbs up. I really enjoyed it, and it is something that I would recommend to others because um, it's not super expensive or anything like that, but it's not so super cheap. It's nicely made for what it is, and I really enjoyed this product. So yeah if you guys enjoyed this little review go ahead and give this two thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button be sure to check me out at naturallylash.wordpress.com to see my written reviews or just stop by my facebook blog channel which is on facebook backslash or slash naturallylash thank you guys for tuning in as always and bye